Hello guys, I'm going to show you how to use a VPN service on your computer. I'm going to use a Swedish service, since it's reliable and fast, I've heard. So let's go to anonine.com. See here. And you click the English tab. Then you go to account. Uh, I'm already logged in, so I'm signing out. Click sign in. Then you click register. Then you fill in username, password, and email, and click register. Then you sign in. Like that. And you click order but here on OpenVPN, right here. And if you're a Swede, you can pay with SMS, otherwise you have to pay with PayPal. Click choose. And you select one, three or 12 month. I take one. Click buy now. And if you got a PayPal account, you fill in here, log in and pay for it. Otherwise, you have to fill in this form with some card numbers and stuff. And you click order it. Then you go back to Anonin when you paid for it. You go to the accounts tab. And you click guides. And depending on what operating system you have, you have to choose the right guide. We're in Windows, so I select Windows. And first of all, we download and install the client. And second, we go to this dir, the config dir of the OpenVPN installation. And we have to put some certificate files in there. And the certificates are in this zip file, so we click it. Click open or then we go to my computer C program files open VPN config select these two like that okay. so now we installed open VPN and we copied the two certificate files to the config map at this location and next we double click this and we get a new tray icon double click it again and here we fill in the username and password that you registered on Anonyme with so I use this and my password now it's connecting to the VPN service Yep, we got a new IP now, so we can double check, so it's okay. Here we can see that we have a new IP address and here's the host, anonymous at anonym. So it seems okay. This means that you can use the BitTorrent technique totally anonymous. So that's nice. And remember if you're in a Windows 7 or Vista environment, you have to right click this icon and se select run as administrator, otherwise it, it uh, won't connect. That's it. Good luck and uh, write in the shout box if you got any questions. Bye-bye.